English class, everyday English, topic one, health. The following lesson assumes that you have watched the lessons from my beginning English class, units one through eight. These lessons can be viewed on my YouTube channel or from my website, beginesl.com. These lessons are designed to be harder than my beginning lessons, but the grammar and vocabulary should not be too difficult if you have viewed the beginning English class lessons. Each of the following lessons will be about specific topics. If you would like to practice English with a certain topic, leave a comment or send me an email at campbell1710 at comcast.net. And thank you for watching Richard Campbell. Welcome to my beginning English language class. The following lesson deals with health care and corresponds to Unit 11 in the Future Series Book 1 textbook. Body Parts The Head Her hair, his forehead, her eyebrows, her eyes, his ears. His nose, his mouth, her teeth, her lip. Her chin, her neck, their shoulders, The body. Chest. Waist. Stomach. Hip. Arms. Elbow, upper arm, forearm, hands, 
thumb. Index finger. Middle finger. Ring finger. Little finger. Legs. Thigh. Knee. Shin. Calf. Feet. Ankle. Toes. Big toe. Heel. Back. Shoulder blades. Left hand. Left forearm. Left elbow. Left upper arm. Right hand, right forearm, right elbow, right upper arm, aches and pains. What is the matter with him? He hurt his right arm. He broke his right arm. He has a broken right arm. What's the question? Who hurt his right arm? What's the question? What did he hurt? What's the question? Which arm did he hurt? Who broke his right arm? He did. Who broke his right arm? What did he break? What did he break? Which arm did he break? Which arm did he break? Who has a broken right arm? He does. Who has a broken right arm? What does he have? A broken right arm.
Which arm is broken? Which arm is broken? His right arm. Aches and pains. What is wrong with him? He hurt his back. He has a backache. His back aches. He has a sore back. Who hurt his back? Who hurt his back? What did he hurt? What did he hurt? Who has a backache? Who has a backache? What does he have? What does he have? What aches? What aches? Who has a sore back? Who has a sore back? What does he have? What does he have? The verbs to hurt, to have, to ache. What is the matter with her? She has a pain in her head. What's the question? Who has pain? She does. What's the question? Where is the pain? Her head aches. What's the question? What aches? She has a headache. The question, who has a headache? The question, what does she have? I am walking. What happened to you? I twisted my ankle. What did you do? I sprained my ankle. What is wrong with you? I have a swollen ankle. What did you twist? My ankle. What did you twist? What did you sprain? My ankle. 
What did you sprain? What do you have? A swollen ankle. What do you have? Who has a swollen ankle? I do. Who sprained their ankle? I did. Who twisted their ankle? I did. The verbs happen, twist, sprain, and have. Subject and object pronouns. I, subject pronoun. Me, object pronoun. You, subject pronoun. You, object pronoun. He, him. She, her. They, them, we, us. She is going to the hospital. The answer to the hospital. Ask me the question. Where is she going? Because she has a broken leg, what's the question? Why is she going to the hospital? She broke her right leg. What's the question? Which leg did she break? How did she break her leg? She was playing soccer in the park. She broke her leg last week. What's the question? When did she break her leg? She broke her right leg while she was playing soccer in the park last week. Now answer my questions. Who broke her right leg while she was playing soccer in the park last week? She did. Now Ask me the question. What did she break while she was playing soccer in the park last week? Which leg did she break while she was playing soccer in the park last week? Now ask me the question. When did she break her right leg? Who was playing soccer in the park last week? She was. Ask me the question. What was she doing in the park last week? What was she playing in the park last week? 
soccer. Ask me the question. Where was she playing soccer last week? When was she playing soccer in the park? Last week. What happened while she was playing soccer? She broke her leg. Doctor's appointment. John, Friday, 4-15-2019, 3.30 p.m. Who has a doctor's appointment? John does. When is his appointment? It is on Friday the 15th. What time is his appointment? It is at 3.30 p.m. John has a doctor's appointment at 3.30 on Friday the 15th at the doctor's office. What time does John have a doctor's appointment? Who has a doctor's appointment at 3.30 on Friday the 15th? Where does John have a doctor's appointment? When does John have a doctor's appointment? The red arrow points to the answer. Now try to ask the questions. The answer on Friday the 15th. The question when does John have a doctor's appointment? What's the question? Where does John have a doctor's appointment? What's the question? What time does John have a doctor's appointment? What's the question? Who has a doctor's appointment at 3.30 on Friday the 15th at the doctor's office? Where is he going? He is going to the doctor's office. Why is he going to the doctor's office? He has a broken leg. What does he have? He has a broken leg. What is wrong with him? He has a broken leg. What is the matter with him? He has a broken leg. Where are they? They are at the doctor's office. 
He is examining the man. He is listening to the man's lungs. The answer is examining, is listening. What's the question? What is the doctor doing? He is breathing. He is taking a breath. Answer is breathing. Answer is taking. What's the question? What is the man doing? He is breathing. He is taking a breath. Why is the man at the doctor's office? He is having his yearly physical. John has a physical at the doctor's office once a year. Who has a physical at the doctor's office once a year? John does. Repeat the question. Who has a physical at the doctor's office once a year? What does John have at the doctor's office once a year? A physical. The question? What does John have at the doctor's office once a year? Where does John have a physical once a year? At the doctor's office. The question? Where does John have a physical once a year? How often does John have a physical? Yearly. Once a year. Answer number one, how often does John have a physical? Number one, he has a physical yearly. Answer number two, he has a physical once a year. Answer number three, he has a physical every year. What do doctors do every day? Doctors listen to patients' lungs at the hospital every day. I will now ask some questions and you say the answers and then repeat the question. Where do doctors listen to patients' lungs? Answer, at the hospital. Question, where do doctors listen to patients' lungs? Who listens to patients' lungs at the hospital every day? The answer, doctors do. What's the question? Who listens to patients' lungs? When do doctors listen to patients' lungs at the hospital? The answer, every day. What's the question? 
When do doctors listen to patients' lungs? What do doctors listen to at the hospital every day? The answer, the patient's lungs. What do doctors listen to? The answer, yes, they do. What's the question? Do doctors listen to patients' lungs? Is the nurse examining the girl? Yes, she is. The nurse is measuring the girl. The answer is measuring. What's the question? What is the nurse doing? The nurse is measuring the girl. Change nurse and girl to a subject and object pronoun. The nurse, she. The girl, her. She is measuring her. How tall is she? She is three feet, eight inches tall. What is her height? Her height is three feet, eight inches. Change height to a subject pronoun. Her height is three feet, eight inches. It is three feet, eight inches. Is the nurse examining the boy? Yes, she is. The nurse is weighing the boy. What's the question? What is the nurse doing? The nurse is weighing the boy. Change the nurse to a subject pronoun. Change the boy to an object pronoun. The nurse, she, is measuring him. How much does he weigh? He weighs 45 pounds. What is his weight? His weight is 45 pounds. Change weight to a subject pronoun. It is 45 pounds. The verbs used in this lesson are hurt, hurting, hurt. Break, breaking, broke. Have, has, having, had. Twist, twisting, twisted. Sprain, spraining is not used in present continuous. Past, sprained is okay. To be, is, am, and are, 
being, was, and were. Do, doing, did. The verb ache is not very common and is not used very often, but it is a verb. Ache, aching, ached. Examine, examining, examined. Breathe, breathing, breathed. Take, taking, took. Measure, measuring, measured. Weigh, weighing, weighed. This is the end of Topic 1, Health, Part A. Thank you for watching.